do, we have three separate things that we do here at Alamo. We feed the homeless, we train the homeless to cook, and we also train the female prisoners at um, uh, Northeast Reintegration Center on East 30th and Broadway to cook. The food bank that I know, I get fresh fruit and vegetables, I get chicken, I get ground beef, I get stuff that a lot of normal people would eat in their homes that I get that I can utilize and feed me. If I didn't have the food bank, I couldn't run my, I couldn't do this job, I couldn't do what we do. When other places stopped doing what they were doing and they, then the people would go, hey, can you help this, can you do this? We didn't even blink and said yes. Another hotel, sure, we'll do it. More people to feed, yes. 150 more that we need to do next week. We didn't stop. Above all, thanks to the food bank, the way that they look out for us, couldn't have done it without them, and, but from the bottom of my heart, I appreciate everything that they do for us. Great Food Restaurant Group, we have several locations in the uh, Cleveland area. Uh, the bulk of our locations are right here at Lake House Square. Any break in routine is, is always welcome, and one that's centered around a positive event where you know, everyone's coming together for things like this just to bring attention to the food bank. So business model here, we've, uh, we've only maintained uh, two locations during the pandemic, uh, Wellsfield Inn and Greenwister Farms. Um, you know, largely relying obviously on uh, delivery and just uh, grab and go or pick up uh, curbside, things like that. You know, one, one thing I will say is that our uh, catering arm uh, provided a lot of uh, you know, meals to frontliners during a few of these weeks, and uh, partnered with Cisco, partnered with the Cleveland Clinic just to provide me that's, you know, it was important, necessary, and great to see. The pandemic first went into effect. Uh, it was, of course, very confusing for all of us, uh, trying to figure out how to navigate uh, running a business, whether we could be open, whether we couldn't be open, and we started working together and we became extremely creative. During these times, the community has been wonderful to us. Uh, they've stepped up in many ways. And most importantly, our website kind of went crazy. We started selling it probably 10 times as much as we had prior. Now that said, we had also lost quite a bit of business because we couldn't allow our guests to come into the store. However, the, the words of kindness, um, things coming in on social media, it was just wonderful, and, uh, and we truly, truly appreciate everything from the community. I'm hoping that the future is going to bring us some really bright, wonderful things. I think that we've learned an awful lot during COVID-19. One of those is just how to deal with each other on, on a, uh, a more friendly and, and more human basis. So I think that the future is going to bring really some wonderful things. I, I look forward to uh, to maintaining some of the things that we've learned, but being, becoming more creative and, um, and just looking towards brighter days. It's, it's going to get better. As Ohio's gaming company, we are extremely passionate about supporting the community we call home, um, which makes it the greater Cleveland community with us having properties both downtown and um, Jack Thistledown in North Randall. And any way we can support those we call our neighbors is a passion project for us and that includes the greater cleveland food bank um, your missions align with ours and serving those who are less fortunate than others in the basic need of food i think it was a, a, a over the past few months i think i learned it was a not a new concept but relearning the resilience we have as a community uh, cleveland has always kind of had that uh, little uh, i don't want to say chip on our shoulder but the notion that it hasn't always been the Cleveland that we live in today. Um, and so going through this um, uncertainty in these unprecedented circumstances as a, as a city, we've come together yet again to prove that that Cleveland strong mentality and that notion that we're going to get through this together. We are so proud to be able to be a partner of the Greater Cleveland Food Bank and uh, all of be in the presence of all the other restaurants that are part of this event and all the events you do. And we are, are grateful for the work you do and are honored to be a part of it.